Welcome to Today in Aviation History. On December 1, 1995, the first flight of an agricultural crop duster aircraft, the Air Tractor AT602, occurred. Crop dusters are highly specialized vehicles built with large hoppers which can hold thousands of pounds of fertilizers or pesticides and sprayers at the trailing edge of the wing for application to the fields. Dusting a field requires significant pilot skill in a vehicle which can operate mere feet off the ground and the maneuverability and power to climb quickly to avoid obstacles like power lines and trees. Air tractors were developed by the grandfather of agriculture aircraft, Leland Snow. Snow was responsible for the design of the two most common ag aircraft, the Thrush and the aforementioned Air Tractor. They share a similar design with deceptively large fuselage for chemical storage, turboprop power plant for efficient fuel burn, and a raised canopy with tremendous visibility. The cockpit has a roll cage around the pilot in case one of those low passes isn't as successful as planned. The Air Tractor has expanded its use case recently with a version designed for fighting fires and even a military version which entered service this year. The Air Tractor is a reliable, rugged, and responsive all quality a pilot wants when trying to juggle the hopper, the sprayers, and low altitude acrobatics all at the same time.